is everyone doing today? It is your boy, Fine as Wine. Today, I'm gonna to be making some simple and easy shrimp and grits, Cajun style. Please stay tuned. I'm gonna give you the recipe step by step. Thanks for showing up, much love. These are all the ingredients that we're gonna need is our Creole seasoning. We have some chicken seasoning, Caribbean style. We have our cheese. That is Mexican cheese onion. We got our red peppers. This is gonna be for our gravy that we make. We have our shrimp that is been peeled, deveined, deshelled, and the ends have been taken off as well, the tails. And this is our original grits, old fashioned style. So please make sure you're using that. I don't recommend you use quick grits. That's just my opinion. But let's go. Actually, a cup and a half, I'll take that. I'm not gonna make too many grits. Slowly add that in there. This is just for just one little quick meal. <clears throat> That's why we're not gonna add too much water. That was that was about a cup and a half of water. That will add again, put your heat on a medium heat, medium high. You can add a little salt to this water. Actually, I'm, <clears throat> I'm not gonna add them salt, I'm gonna add a little butter. And I have the, I can't believe it's not butter. That's what I'm gonna add. We're gonna allow that to come to a nice little bubble sizzle and we're gonna add our grits okay be right back all right guys now that this has come to a boil we're gonna add our grits so we added about a cup and a half of water we're gonna add one cup of grits just whisk that in there I've been cooking grits for so many years, so I kind of know what's enough and what's not enough. So that's perfect. We are gonna put the top on it and let it come to a boil. Turn it on a high heat. And then we're gonna keep it on a high heat for about four minutes. And then we're gonna Completely turn it off and keep it on the hot eye. We'll be back. It has come to a nice thickness. That is the consistency that we want. So at this point, we're gonna put the top over it to let the steam cook it a little bit longer. I turn my fire completely down. And then once we feel like it's ready, we, we're gonna put it, sit it to the side. Take this time now to season our grits. You want to make sure that you have flavor in there. So this is black pepper. Okay, and we're gonna add a little bit of the seasoning blend that I have here. Gives it a little color.
Go ahead and give it a little taste. It needs a little more seasoning. Okay, so our grits are done. We're gonna sit that to the side and we're gonna start working on our shrimp and our gravy, our Cajun gravy. Yes. So we can add our olive oil. Go ahead and add your raw shrimp. We're going to get a nice brown on the shrimp. We're going to make sure we season it with some black pepper. And since this is a, like a Cajun dish, we're going to make sure we add our Cajun seasoning on there. I do like a lot of black pepper. Season those shrimp really nice. Y'all know I don't play, I clean as I go. Season the hell out of them if you can. Let me see what else I can add to this. I can actually add a little curry for a kick. And then I'm going to add a little Lori seasoning salt. Alright, and we're going to stir that. But these don't require that you cook long, but we wanted a good browning on them, so we can turn our heat up a little bit more so they can brown. Then we'll come back when they're brown.
we're gonna work on our gravy. So we're gonna add some butter. That's the first thing we're gonna add. We're gonna start sauteing our vegetables. Our red peppers and our onions. Allow your skillet to get hot. Again, the dishes that we did cook so far, the shrimp and the grits are sitting to the side. And we're gonna add them once everything is finished. That's about a tablespoonful of butter. Allow that butter to melt.
go ahead and add you about two teaspoonfuls of it. Okay, stir that around in there. That's gonna help us make the gravy, all right? A lot of people use the beef broth. I chose to use the beef flavoring. Slowly add water and a little flour. About a teaspoon full, okay. You want to make sure that your water is hot and not cold. gonna start thickening up and to get thicker you add more water but slowly add the water be enough water we're gonna let this thicken up a little bit we're gonna start seasoning it also add your little lorry seasoning and some more Cajun seasoning If you need more water, you can go ahead and add it. That'll level, level everything out, the water. That levels everything out. Don't be afraid to go ahead and taste it. See if it's at the liking that you want. This is a late night snack for me. Be sure that your uh, heat is on a like a low heat. So go ahead and give that a taste.
That's gonna also level out the flavors.
This is my better than ever Cajun shrimp and grits. You guys see that? That's what's up. Please share your boy out. Hit that subscribe button. Much love. Thank you so much for watching.